Hey, how's it going? Just going to show you how to play the theme song from Daria today, which is originally called You're Standing on My Neck by Splendora. Um, just before we jump into it, I'll let you know you can now support me on Patreon. There's a link below to my Patreon as well as a video explaining what all that is. You can also follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and I've also got a Spotify playlist link below, which has got all the songs I've done tutorials for on it, so you can browse through it and see if you want to learn anything. Also, if you could like and subscribe, that would be great. Anyway, now that's out of the way, let's jump into the lesson. Um, so for this lesson, I'm going to split it into sort of two two halves. I've made a cover of the Daria theme song, which I've linked below as well. So I'll teach you all the parts that are in the theme song, so you can play that. And then um, there's only one or two other parts that are in the original that aren't in the theme song, so I'll, I'll teach them at the end. All right, so I'll go through section by section and give you an example of what you need to learn, and then I'll teach it to you. Cool. So for this one, we're just in standard tuning and using a pick. All right, so the first thing we hear in the theme song is this. So it's just one chord, and we're just going to be fretting the third fret on the fourth string and the second fret on the third string. And so we play third string, fourth string, second string, that's the open second string, and then just, yeah, these three. So you go three, four, two, three, four, three, four, two, three, four, in terms of picking. So that's that chord. You hear this a couple of times um, in the theme song. Also happens at the end. Um, so that's that first bit. Then we get into the sort of the verse riff, which is this. So um, it could be power chords or it could just be one note. I think it's just one note and then the chorus is power chords that I'll show you in a second. Um, so for this, we're just starting all on the sixth string, this verse. First fret, up to the fourth fret, back to one, back to four, back to one. Then we go up to six, then eight. So, so far you've got Then just before we get to the chorus, we've got Whoop. Um, So it's just six, four, six, eight And you can do a little Just a little bend on the six so that's that. Then we've got the chorus, um, which is this. So it's just three power chords. So starting uh, fourth fret on the fifth string with your first finger and then with your third or your fourth finger whatever's co most comfortable um, sixth fret on the fourth string then the second power chord we just move everything down a string so we've got four on the sixth string and six on the fifth string then we just slide it up two frets so you've got six on the sixth string and eight on the fifth string and you can sort of like re-slide up to that. So it's just. So you just play that uh, three or four times, I think. And that's all the rhythm parts for um, all the sections that are in the theme song for Daria. And then we've just got, there's yeah a lead line that happens. So in the verse, you've just got this slide So it's just 11th fret to 8th fret on the first string. So that's over. And it just happens, you just play it twice. So 11 to 8. Then over the chorus, the lead line is this. All 
right, so it's mainly just repeating this sort of one little phrase. So we start it all on the second string, we're just sliding up and down this second string. So we're starting on the 14th fret. Then we go 9, slide up to 16, and then 9, slide to 11. So you get... So you do this three times, and then the fourth time, um, you get... And then you stop when you get to sort of the, the top of the, the riff. So this last time around, starting on the 14th fret again, 9, slide up to 16, but then instead of going 9 to 11, we just go 16, slide back to 15 and then finish on, just do like a staccato stop on the uh, on the 14th fret. Right, so that's all the parts that you need to play along with the theme from Daria. Um, so there's only kind of two other parts to play along with the whole track by Splendora. There's, I guess it's a bridge, um, which is this. So we've just got some power chords here again. So starting on the 6th fret on the 6th string and 8th on the 5th string. Then we go up to uh, 4 on the 5th and 6 on the 4th. Then slide that over 2. So you've got 6 on the 5th and 8 on the 4th. And you just play these three. Um, then we've just got two dissonant chords to learn. Um, so we know this part. Um, there's a section in the song where it um, just sort of moves up a string and you hear this. So for this, we're just holding down the uh, third fret on the second and third strings and we're playing the open top string as well. So for this picking pattern, we just go two, three, one, two, three. So that's that other chord. And just in the outro, um, when we hear this, everything just moves up a fret. For, I think just twice round and you hear and then it goes back to the original spot so for this chord we've just got three on the third four on the fourth and one on the second string and again the picking pattern is third string fourth two three four three four two three four But that's all the parts to this song, uh, You're Standing on My Neck by Splendora, the theme from Daria, which is just a classic and something I remember fondly growing up. Um, thanks so much for watching and listening. Hope you enjoyed that lesson and, and enjoyed playing along with the original. Um, if you've got any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll try to get to them. Like I said at the top of the video, you can support me on Patreon, uh, you can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and I've got that Spotify playlist that you can check out if you want. Um, but that's it. I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching.